Good morning, everyone. How are you guys? Happy New Year. What a what an evening. <laughs> Hope you guys brought in the New Year's just like we did last night live. It was amazing live, and I thank you guys all. First, before I get into anything, I want to say thank you to everyone who is my not only followers, but um, friends and customers who has made this all happen. So thank you for supporting Amore Fabrics and um and just me i mean it's helped me out um so much has changed this year i went from etsy shop all over to shopify absolutely huge change so if i would say anything i mean to those who want to make goals for this year i hope maybe i can encourage you guys to try something new try to do something that um you are maybe scared to do i know a lot of people are kind of afraid to be shop owners kind of thing and take that huge leap I say go for it. You know, you got a lot of support teams. You got more fabrics and a lot of other people I can also direct you to. But there's so many people who can support you and help you and to make the steps. My husband's cooking. It's always cooking um, to uh, get ahead. So that's my encouragement for those who want to try something new for the year. Step outside your comfort zone and just go for it. I know that's what I did. And I'm so grateful that I took the the steps to do that. I mean, I can't say it's going to be easy because it's totally not going to be easy. But I'll tell you what, I love it. I mean, you got your good days, your bad days. Um, but I'll tell you what, it's brought me where I'm at, um, and I'm I'm in I'm in enjoying every bit of it. So I want to say thank you guys because you guys are a big piece of that. As you can see here on the screen, I'm going to go over and tell you guys the new things for this new year. As you can see, it's a more vintage finds. No, I didn't change my shop. If anything, um, I transferred over a shop I had on Etsy um, that I haven't really talked a whole lot about, um, mainly because my daughter, Abby, for those who know, uh, about four or five years ago, I started her own shop. It's called Abby's Vintage Shop. I'll put her link down below. You guys could check out her Etsy shop as well. But I had handed it over to her now that she's 18. And um, I never got to talk about my vintage shop. So surprise now you guys get to know it so when I go to estate sales and things like that the things that um, I get I'll be putting into the shop that are non crafty items of course a more fabrics which you guys know me as a more fabrics that'll be everything um, crafty vintage kind of thing junk journaling crafty knitting cross stitching all that good stuff quilting but a more vintage finds obviously as you can see here I'm gonna stop talking here in a minute and give you guys the entire screen here but um, it'll have brooches, necklaces, all the things, like I said, non-crafty kind of thing. So, yes, yeah, so don't forget to go look down below my daughter's Etsy shop. Again, check her out. She does an amazing job. Another reason to encourage those who want to try to open an Etsy shop or Shopify shop, you can do it. I mean, my daughter's had it for, like I said, four or five years, and she's 18 now. And now she's got something established. It takes time, but you can do it. Just open it up. It costs you nothing to open it up, and then just go for it. So... Yeah, so what else am I missing here? So, um, yeah, I'm going to show you the shop. Um, it's going to have its own YouTube channel, so it's going to be kind of transitioning those who um, from a more fabrics to check out a more vintage find YouTube as well. My goal, okay, so what is Selena's goal this year? Obviously, I, I transferred over all my shops, anything vintage. You guys know I love anything vintage. So my goals this year, because I just moved to Pensacola from the north. I used to be from Indiana. I'm learning the area, all the state sells. I would love to take you guys to a live auction. Um, I want to take you to, um, Golf Breeze has a lot of things that are new to me. So I figured I can showcase shops there and then at least share those shops. I'll get their approval first. Because I'm sure there's like local shops around here who love to have their name uh, spoken on YouTube. So that's one goal. Definitely, like I said, a live auction is on my checklist. Um, uh, my goal is to, um, I know there's, I always get a list of items that uh, followers are asking to look for. I've been looking for this, Lena, can you find this? So my goal is to check off that list um, by also bringing you guys to more vintage finds because a lot of the finds that people are asking for are things that are non-crafty. And uh, so now I can kind of direct you over here as well. So you guys have uh, the taste of both sides, you know, um, kind of thing and I hope you guys like it. I know I've worked since September Holly and I have worked really hard designing this this page and uh, I hope it's easy and I'll go over that with you guys. So my goal, yeah, that was my goal and my goal is um, finally just to add these things in my shop. For the last year or two I've been 
transitioning, moving over things, and now it's time to have fun filling the shop up, taking you guys places. There's so many places. I like to get out of the side of these four walls. I'm in here all day, every day, most of the time, and it would be nice just to jump in a car and take you guys places and then find you some cool finds to put into here. So, okay, I'm done yakking. Don't forget to click on the links down below, the new YouTube channel, subscribe. It's only going to have this video in it right now, but there will be more kind of thing. Um, and I'll just take you guys here and show you guys the shop. Um, there is everything in the shop is on sale. I made sure that the store opening, it's going to be on sale. So I'll go over that. And then I was going to do a test run. I have a coupon for you guys of 20% off on top of those sales. So I was going to do a test run and see how it looks kind of thing. I mean, I haven't had a chance to do that. And I figured I'll do it with you guys. All right, let me press this on pause and let's try this out. I hope I did this. So if I'm still talking right now. <laughs> <laughs> Again, I'm put this down. All right, it should just be a more fabrics. As you guys can see, it's going to have like this screen. It's going to display beautiful vintage photos that I put on there. Um, if those who know Pickabee, uh, Pickabee, I think that's what it is. I'll put the link down below. It has all kinds of really cool photos that are free for those who are shop owners. That if you want to try out, um, if you want to find really cool photos that you can use that are free kind of thing. Sometimes it's hard to take your own photos. So there's a great website for that. I'll make sure I link that down below. Okay, so here, welcome to more vintage finds. Up at the top here, you're going to see, of course, I have something in my cart because I want to share with you guys how to do it. But right here is this cute little thing. It's supposed to be a person. You could click on that. Don't forget to email, put your password in. That's how you sign in. It doesn't require anything else kind of thing for you. So do that, um, and you can put your e um, email address here. I imagine if you put it here too, but it give you a newsletter. I do updates and stuff like that. I have a blog, so it tells you if I add anything new. Also, you can check the YouTube channel as well. Um, what else? So I'm going to go back home. I won't go to the shopping cart yet, but I wanted to really try that coupon out kind of thing. But okay, as you can see here, um, brooches, necklaces, rings, earrings, and stuff. I'm adding more things as I go. Some things are coming soon. I just haven't had a chance to add them to it. Clothes is a really cool, fun addition. Um, I have a lot more purses I have to add as well. Vintage home, I have a ton coming. I only have one item going on in here. Same thing with books. Thing with having a shop, it takes time to list. So I try my best. Sometimes it's so much easier to just go live on YouTube or show do a video on YouTube, and you guys go run and grab it really th really fast kind of thing. But um, let me take give you guys a peek. Don't forget to click on the link down below to the direct link to get to the shop. But click on that and look around. I mean, I have like here's 39 brooches that I just added. Um, like I said, everything is on sale. As you can see, you can see this was 28. It's now 23. <clears throat> I had so much fun researching, but a lot of this stuff I knew. Uh, my parents were antiquers um, and I grew up in that type of lifestyle. So I knew a lot of the things. I'm really new at clothing especially the measuring of clothing. <clears throat> I, I mean, I know fabric. I'm just got to learn how to do that. But other than that, I'm having fun with that. It's so much fun. So necklaces are probably my favorite. Of course, there's rings <clears throat> because there's so many different types of styles. I had so much fun. And a lot of this stuff I've had for years. <clears throat> I just haven't had a chance to really show it off. I mean, probably half of this I had in the Etsy shop. But now you guys can see you know, have a chance. I had, I had fun adding stuff. But as you can see, like I said, everything is on sale. So what I did is over here, um, as you can see, there's a drop down menu. It has different languages, so different currencies, I should say. Um, so far as when you go to check out, say if you're from Canada, it will have the currency so it's easy for you to see what the total is kind of thing. This is my favorite part. Okay, I added this to the cart for myself. I absolutely love this. I'm going to give you guys a peek this this necklace. I'm not going to buy my own item, but when you're on a listing, as you can see, I put the cursor right on the picture and it gives you a great zoom in. You don't have to do anything, but put your cursor there to see the details of any of the photos that you have here. Isn't that cool? I love that about Shopify. So if you want to see the back of it kind of thing, it gives you a great zoom. Like it'll show you here, there's like this here, even though it's beautiful, it does have like a little bit, um, of the, um, I want to say rust, but um, my brain today, guys. Not just today, this week. I don't know about you guys, but um, 
Oh my, it's just been one of those weeks that uh, I think maybe just so much after Christmas and stuff. Okay, so back to the car up here is your shopping cart or your shopping bag. Um, so it's just going to tell you what the price is. And a total, my favorite, favorite, favorite part is the checkout section because you got a PayPal button. Most I use PayPal most of the time. This is awesome. You have Google Pay. Um, and down below, as you can see, all the major credit cards as well. Um, so I'm going to go check out. Holly's probably going to have to put up some really cool star. Oh, she already put it in there kind of thing. I'll have a star so she doesn't see my personal information. But you get to choose your um, type of mailing options. Of course, it won't be media mail. Bless you, husband. You just sneeze. I'll have to take that option down in the shop because I don't have media up right now. So it's good I'm doing it. So it's teaching me I have to change something because the new the shop is so new. As you guys can see, I'm giving you guys a shop coupon called Store Open. I just remembered that, or I'm going to put it down below, just copy and paste it, because this is where you put it when you check out. It says discount code. Put it there. It's going to take off 20% of that total, which is $4, which is awesome, because it was $20 already marked down. So pretty much it covered your shipping cost and then some. So not a bad deal, 20% off of what you got going on here. So don't forget to put that sh shipping code in there and then continue to pay kind of thing, which I don't need to do that. <laughs> um, just continue to pay, choose your payment options kind of thing, and then you're done. That easy. So I hope that was helpful, and I'm so excited, and I'll be quite honest, very, very nervous. I Trying something new and changing things over, doing something that is totally outside your comfort zone is always nerve-wracking. I have this on pens and needles, but I do hope you guys absolutely love it as much as I do. Again, so many things are going to be changing and added. Um, the rings are pretty cool, too. Um, yeah, this one's my favorite here. But yes, yeah, so check it out. Check out what I've I, we have worked really hard on. Up here is a blog. Uh, I think I only blogged one thing, and that was in September. That's when I just uh, started the shop, September twelfth. But I did my first. <laughs> I just did my first blog kind of thing, so where I can share it on Facebook. So anytime I have something new and newly listed and stuff, I can share it on Facebook, tweet it or pen it kind of thing. Which I love the pen idea. But, yeah, so I hope you guys love it. I'm going to add things, show you guys all the time, and um, hope you guys like my New Year change and New Year style. Um, I have a more fabrics, and I have a more vintage find, so, which is perfect for both worlds of the crafter and the non-crafter. Again, I thank you guys so much uh, for the time to watch this video, to see this. Check it out. Get that 20% off coupon today. Um, like I said, everything's on sale as it is. And like I said, the YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe to that new YouTube channel. That is going to be awesome because you'll see what's new, what's coming in. And if there's something you are seriously looking for, just email me. My email is down below. Um, and just uh, send me a, a note, and I will do my best to find it on one of my you know trips out there. I'm so excited about this New Year goal, and I can't wait to hit the road and have some fun outside these four walls and, uh, and shop. Nothing like shopping, guys. All right, guys, until next time, uh, you guys have a beautiful new year, and I can't wait to see what next to bring you guys. Have a good one, guys. Let's see if I can turn this off. All right, bye, guys.